Hi, this is Isabel Litzler, Pleiad HC, the place to be to develop your skills and grow your potential. So today I want to make a video on how to target your applications right, because I find that too many people are just applying a little bit everywhere as a strategy, and this is definitely not working in Switzerland. So I want to give you three tips on how to improve your target in your job search. So the first one is really to understand what your competencies are and, and what is your proper uh, target for the type of work that you're looking for. So, for example, if you're a manager and you have some years of experience, but you really, really need a job and you're not hearing back from employers, starting to apply for internships or junior positions is not going to help you. It's only going to hurt you because not only will you not get hired, but on top of that, you will hurt your resume. You will hurt yourself by sending your resume to recruiters that will not find that you're credible. So for example, if you have a company and there's not so many companies to apply for, so it's usually the same ones, especially if you're a highly specialized profile. So let's say you have a company, we'll call it Bank X, that you really like and you apply there for a position that's at your right level and you're not hearing back, probably the um, next thing will be for you to actually start to think, okay, what if I apply to all the job openings there? Maybe one of them will work and I will get a call. But from the recruiter's perspective, it's only making you lose credibility. So they will think, well, why is this person applying for a junior job now? What is that? You know, um, is this hiding something? Maybe they're not as good of a manager as they're supposed to. So you see you raise questions that shouldn't even be there. So because you have a small market in Switzerland and you have so many places you can only apply to, I would really be extremely, extremely focused because this is how you will at some point convince somebody that you're the right person. So number one is really to avoid sending your resume everywhere and keep focus. Number two, to avoid, you know, the whole I'm not applying for the right position is to really understand what is your right level of a position. So really based on your background and what you're looking for, you need to ask yourself, you know, at this stage, what type of position is right for me? You know, maybe I'm too junior and I've been targeting for something that's way out of my reach or also based on the market, you know, what type of roles are suited for me. So this is really individual work that you need to do either alone or with somebody where you find out exactly where is your best market, I would say. So that's tip number two. Tip number three is really to understand in your job search which companies are hiring for the type of competencies that you have. So unfortunately, some people stick around in the same type of activity for a very long time and they keep applying when there's no real market there. So if you've been looking for a marketing job, for example, for a year or something like that, and you're not hearing back, it could be a positioning issue. Maybe you're sending it to the wrong places and you're sending it at the wrong level. But I think more than not, it's probably because there's not many positions there. So maybe you need to review what you need to do to now open up new doors. And this is really work around maybe I need to retrain myself in something new or expand maybe a little bit, etc., etc. So I hope this video was helpful. Again, feel free to leave your comments. Thanks.